kids, but uh, my height does uh, not help me with that as they uh, tend to grow taller than me fairly quickly. Is this writing big enough for you guys? I thought about becoming a primary school teacher, but uh, the year four kids really intimidate me. The height helped me though. I used to sneak up on students and listen to their conversations. They wouldn't even know I was there, but uh, the bright vest has uh, ruined my disguise now. Um, I didn't leave school striving to be a teacher, but uh, somehow I ended up here. And yeah. What, Nick? <laughs> Riley. <laughs> Riley. Riley. All right, guys, you ready? Hi, Mrs. Hartley. Welcome to my maths class, and I really love maths. Okay, so today we're going to be learning about graphs. So here we have our exponential graph. It goes like this. Uh, here we have our x-axis and our y-axis. Oh, I'm sorry. Uh, a y-axis and our x-axis. Well, that's all we have time for today, um, so I'll see you guys later, and remember that I love you so, so, so much. Look at those ears. Ears of a legend. They are. The legend. Hello, I'm Mr. Laffin. I'm new to Norwest this year, coming from Ardell, and if you're thinking the name sounds familiar, it is the same Laffin as the Laffin Building. And on that note, Laffin Incorporated and Laffin Inc. and Laffin Industries. It's a Laffin world. Okay, open up to a fresh page in your book, guys. Uh, I've got a writing task for you. Write a two word summary of ancient history. No more, no less. Okay, we have so much content to get through today, guys. I'm really, really worried about our position. We've only got two weeks left and we've got most of the syllabus to cover. We really need to plow through. So, first, I'm gonna start with the game. Everyone bring a new sheet of paper out. Sir, mm -hmm. can you remind me what the Claros is? Ah, well if you remember what I was saying the other day, it's kind of like how what Hitler did in Germany. And then Rasputin drunk the soup, and they thought it killed him, so they threw him in the river, but he wasn't dead. And then Captain Cook landed here, and thus Australia was born. And here we are. May I answer your question? Not at all. Let me give you another example. My name is Rodney Leslie Brain. Um, you know who else has a brain? My wife. Speaking of which, have I ever told you the story about how I met my wife? It's a great story. I'll tell you guys again. My name's Luke Barnett. I'm an English teacher here at Norwest Christian College. I have been for the past 10 years. My hobbies include reading My Little Pony comics to my little daughter. I enjoy reading comics because they're not too complex to read. And I enjoy watching the Miami Heat basketball team play. In total, there's 40 ribs. Um, there's 15 on this side and 35 on this side. Jesse, first of all, you're late. You come in here with your shake. Your hair is in the air conditioner. Doesn't even turn on anymore. I'm sick of it. Get out. Jesse, stop. Jesse! Jesse, I've never met someone so stupid as you in my life. Je Jesse, stop. Jesse, I'm not. I'm gone. This is the humerus, um, this bone here, um, the two of them, humerus one and humerus two. Jesse, stop. Um, and the clavicle is this one right here. S sir? S sir? What? Um, can, I can I please have some help? In half an hour. Okay, today class, first I think it's simile. Hate similes! Anyway, back to what we're saying. You've got to frighten first person with your essays. That's plain rule number one. Alright, class lesson, just do that. Now remember, you're not human photocopiers, so just get just get the gist of it down, okay? Okay, have you got that all down? Yeah? Okay. 
I'm going to just tell you a story right now. My name is Belinda O'Connor. I'm the school librarian here at Northwest Christian College. I've been here for a few years now. Uh, I can't say I particularly enjoy the majority of the day. Um, recess and lunch are always good. Um, I usually take that time to have a quick nap in my car. Uh, it helps me uh, re-energize for the next wave of students. <laughs> Apart from my teaching role, ensuring students wear the right uniform is an important part of my day. Um, discipline is also something I look forward to in the mornings. Boy, get back to work! My day is often very busy. I'm always attending to my classes and making sure that they're doing their work. And, and when I don't have any students in here, I, I'm still working very hard. I, I refill the printer with paper, I tidy the desks, and, and that's about it, really. There's not much else to do around here. I'll let you in a little secret. I've been playing some great games here recently on the interweb. I've been playing Pac-Man, Tetris, I've been on the YouTube. It's great. Um, I've been uh, playing Cube Field. I also find the Insight games a challenge. You know, the, the ones that the primary kids play, um, they're, they're quite fun. I often try to find new ways to help make school fun for all the students. I find singing on the microphone an effective moral booster. No! 